So I really want to show you some Jan Marini items that I've been sent. I love Jan Marini skincare. If if I could pick uh, two skincare lines that I would love, I would say Clarins and Jan Marini. I see the most results with them. So this is the Antioxidant Daily Face Protectant. This one's tinted. You can get it untinted, just like a clear lotion. Mine is Sunkiss Neutral. They are so sheer, so the colors are very forgiving. But what I love most, it's waterproof and SPF 30. It also says broad spectrum sunscreen provides protection against UVA and UVB radiation. Here's what it looks like. And here it is on my hand. Now this stuff does oxidize. So it will darken a little bit on your skin. It is sheer though. I absolutely love it. If I'm if I know it's gonna be hot out, I don't want to wear a lot of makeup. I'll just throw this on and maybe a powder. <laughs> Seriously, your SPF 30. And it's a big tube, 2 ounces. Seems like all the skincare lines are coming out with primers, which is kind of cool. Because they're putting in the skincare benefits along with priming the face before makeup application. So Jamarini recently came out with the Age Intervention Prime Face Primer. Looks like this. Pretty cool bottle. So it comes in a pump tube. It's like a yellow color, I have no idea why. It might be one of the ingredients that helps brighten the skin. But if you want to see results, try out Jamarini. Oh, and it feels so silky. Oh, it's great. And it's not slippery. Some of them are too too much dimethicone could be slippery. That's definitely more mattifying. That's a really good one. Love it. So I've slowly been collecting not really collecting, like purchasing um, Lime Crime lipsticks, and I'm sure you guys have seen all these. The packaging is freaking so cute. I love, I love it. Hologram, hol holographic hologram. What do you call it? <laughs> it's Lime Crime. So, love it. It's just cool. It's really cool. Nice, nice packaging. Good quality. The first three I bought is Airborne Unicorn. And it is totally like a purple. It looks like Blooming Lovely from Liberty of London. The second I purchased is Delilac. And this is totally like one I have to mix with others because it is so light. It's such a light lilac color. So here it is. It's very blue tone lilac. In fact, if you mix Airborne Unicorn and a Lilac, it's like the perfect purple shade. And then the last one that I bought the first time I bought them is Great Pink Planet. It is like Saint Germain from MAC. It's also, it's just that bubblegum pink, I'll call it. Not Barbie pink, because Barbie pink to me is like hot pink, you know? It's like bubblegum pink. Love it. Okay, so the next two I purchased together, just like last week, this one's called Countessa, and it is like a Barbie hot pink. It's really pretty. Then the last one I'm wearing is called Cosmopop, and I never wear like oranges, ever. I'm totally like a pink girl or purple. So I wanted to try and see how this looks. I really kind of like this orange because it's like a milky, it's like a milky peach color. It is in the orange family, definitely. So this is Cosmopop. So with Cosmopop, I used Illamasqua's Medium Pencil for Eyes, Lips, Face, and Body. The color is called Definitive. And there it is like a coral. Okay, so I did all the swatches. <laughs> the first one is Airborne Unicorn. The second one is Delilac. The third one is Great Pink Planet. The fourth one is Countessa. And the last one that I'm wearing is Cosmopop. 
And this is a swatch of the Illamasqua uh, Medium Pencil in Definitive. This is so weird. Um, these lipsticks stain. <laughs> Cosmopop didn't, but Airborne Unicorn, Delilac, Great Pink Planet, and Countessa did. This is uh, wiped off with a MAC wipe. Okay, so the last thing I wanted to talk about is new Lush products. This is the Space Girls Bath Bomb. I guess supposedly it's supposed to crackle like uh, Cinder's does, or did when it was out. So here's the glitter. I showed the one that I got from the UK. This is from Canada or the US. Now I already used the other one. I love it. The scent doesn't stay very long I heard and I have to kind of agree with that. It didn't last as long as some of the other scents do. And I'm not a fan of glitter but the smell is so great. It's like sweet tarts. Those candies. Oh, I always forget. Anyways, um, this one I also bought from the UK and but this one I've already used from the UK so here's another it's called Happy Blooming Bath Melt and you can cut it up into three pieces where you see the lines it smells like sweet cherries like maraschino cherries not like real cherries it is super hydrating okay, this is called Turkish Delight and it is Fine. polish smooth a handful of rose scented Decadently whipped butters all over your body to perfume, soothe, and soften your skin. Wash off with warm water. So it adds a scent to it, so maybe you don't need lotion afterwards. So it's Turkish Delight. Wow. Here it is. This is rich. This is a body, a body polish. Look at how rich it is. It totally smells like roses. If you don't like the smell of roses, don't get it, but this is a strong rose smell, and I love roses, so this is a really good one if you like rose smells. Floral. Mmm. I love rose. <laughs> it's very strong, though. Also, they have the new lip scrubs, and it's pretty cool. They have three out. Their first one is bubblegum. literally smells like bubblegum. And it, I believe it's sugar. It's castor sugar, organi organic jojoba oil, flavor, and like the dye. So there it is. So it's very sweet. It's like all natural and still really yummy smelling. This one is called Sweet Lips. It's like vanilla chocolate. If you like Tootsie Rolls, it smells exactly like a Tootsie Roll. Exactly like a Tootsie Roll. And then the last product, lip scrub, is Mint Juleps. <laughs> it's so cute. So it's peppermint and chocolate. Mmm. And the peppermint mm, feels so soothing. With just a little chocolate background, like mint chocolate chip ice cream. If you like that, you'll like this. There it is. I'm really loving their new stuff. Thank you so much for watching. Um, I hope some of you or any of you found this useful. Um, as always, please leave um, a comment below if you need me to do a specific review or just leave a comment to say hi and please subscribe and thank you to my subscribers and yeah, have a good day. Thank you. Bye.